Hey now guys, it's me David from Calling All Gamers here with uh, another episode of Struggling with Math episode, or wait, excuse me, week 14 and 15. Sorry I've been lagging a little bit. There was a lot of studying, a lot of things going on at work, uh, some personal stuff in my life. Um, but besides that, it looks like I'm back on tune uh, there's probably two episodes or two weeks left in a semester, which means this series is coming to a close. My whining and complaining about math is going to uh, end soon. And uh, who knows? Who knows what's after this? Probably back to the whole uh, regularly as scheduled program kind of shit. What you're looking at is a po- Fallout, one of my... Uh, games I like to go to, play from time to time, and there's the pause screen, and here we got Whiprush on the Sega Genesis, awesome game, awesome game, okay, so uh, what what is there to say, well, I failed my last test, despite all the studying I did, it kind of bummed me out because I worked really hard, but I also got to remember that I'm not good at math to begin with, and the kind of bullshit that I had to learn and all the formulas and things I had to uh, memorize. Uh, it was a bit of a, it was a struggle. That's why I was struggling with math because it's a struggle. I got no idea what I was doing. Um, I got a 45. Uh, overall, I'm not too disappointed because, well, uh, the, the, the professor, he drops the worst grade. It's, um... It's not too bad. He dropped the first grade. It doesn't count towards your final grade. But that does uh, kind of irk me a little bit. Because, you know, I put all this time and effort and there was nothing to show for it. Oh, my God. I'm getting those feelings again that I might not be able to pull it off. But I got to remember, all that's left is the final. If I could just get a C on the final, I'm good. I'm good and it's all it's, it's cool. Uh, nothing much to say. Um, oh, uh, Target Earth on uh, Sega Genesis. Uh, it's another pre Sonic uh, Genesis game. In Japan, it was called Assault Suit Lenos. It's getting a remake on the PS4, which, which, um, I'm kind of jealous at all the PS4 gamers because they're getting this game <laughs> they, they're getting this game and it kind of like it makes me jealous because I would really love to play a, a remake of this game but uh, you know that, that's a whole different matter ooh I got a girlfriend <laughs> I finally got a girlfriend and I got laid and it's awesome <laughs> uh, I, I would eventually go ahead and um, delve into it a little bit more but but you know that I'll I'll, uh, I'll do something else. When, when, you know I'll, I'll make a whole different video based off that. But anyway, talking about my new girlfriend, uh, I I fi- I finally got her to. Uh, well, and I got finally got her, but I kind of spontaneously brought this up on her. I've been trying to do this whole new video series called Force Enjoyment. I originally intended it to do with my ex, but uh, she dumped me for someone else. So. <laughs> So, uh, so that went out the crap shoot. I was thinking of doing Force Enjoyment with my sister, but she got other things going. And then there was Force Enjoyment with Chris, but he's already a gamer, and uh, he kind of already knows how to play games. So the whole thing with um, with making uh, Chris play uh, video games it, it wouldn't really work out the idea of force enjoyment was to get casual gamers or, or non-gamers to play video games uh real real difficult ones or ones that that require skill and um and i have i pretty much seen how they pull it off and kind of like um see what what the hell um how well they do uh, you'll be surprised to how uh, Maria pulls off uh, Killer Instinct, you know, the first game I, I make her play. But, uh, but yeah, you know, 
pretty much it's kind of like testing the ground, see how it works. Uh, in the future, I'll probably make her play some other games and hopefully get other people, um, other people involved. Uh, but uh, that's pretty much it. Uh, leave any uh, comments and um, and stuff below. And like always, have a good one. Catch you later, guys.